Dela Wright, my MVVs, welcome. Three are the rare workers who are alleged to be working with Olori Runke have resigned their job. From what we are hearing allegedly, they said they can no longer be used to hold Queen Naomi again because apart from being a direct workers, they also double as bloggers who are busy maligning Queen Naomi's character on social media. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Dela Ram. I bring you fresh and spicy juice from the sauce and still on the Royals. How are you guys doing? I appreciate you. I love you. I thank you. I'm grateful, people. Thank you so much. May God bless you. May God grant you your heart desire. Please, if you're here and you're yet to subscribe, kindly go ahead and hit that subscribe button and do not forget to turn on the notification bell and do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. A lot of you keep asking me, how do you recommend me for, um, how do you set me up for recommendation? You set me up for recommendation by, you know, um, um, you know, um, giving uh, my video thumbs up. Report reaching us right now is that three Adi Adire workers have resigned from the Adire company. Um, it is alleged that Olori Runke um, uh, is the one who is managing the Adire tie and die company in Ife. They said it's a big company. We are all aware that she is the owner, or allegedly that she is the owner of the African Fashion Week and the London Fashion Week. That is the alleged information. And so they say they are the ref uh, company um, in Ife. She is the one who is beheading it. And they are trying to promote the Adire fabric around the globe. And that is moving very well around Brazil to, and uh, Trinidad and Tobago and all of that, that she has put in a whole lot of work on it and she's using it to also create, um, build capacity for the young people in um, uh, Ile Ife. Right now, it is alleged that uh, some of these people who are working with her, uh, you know, they've been grumbling enough this time, not because they are not being paid. They have been uh, paid and taken care of. They said these three women are saying that they can no longer be used to hurt Olori Naomi anymore, that Naomi has not done anything particularly to them, that they don't have anything personal with Olori Naomi, that people cannot be using them to hurt her, that apart from being staffed to um, uh, uh, Olori Runke, they also double as bloggers. You see that if you go around social media, you see a lot of blogs where they say a lot of terrible things about Queen Naomi. I don't know if you guys have seen those blogs. Like um, last week, I came across a blog where they were saying some very, as in unprintable things about Queen Naomi. How they are dragging bloggers, that bloggers are lying, bloggers are this, only of if does not want Naomi, only of if could care less about Naomi and all of that. Yes, so the truth remains that anybody can say that only of if does not want Naomi, but it does not change the reality of things in um, the palace of the Oni of Ife. Like for me, De La Ram, when I come here, I bring gist to you guys. I do not tell you that I am there. I prepare your mind for you to know that these are alleged news and it's up to you to think um, of it the way you want to think of it. So right now, they say these women have come up with, to say that they can no longer be allowed, they will not longer, they will no longer be allowed themselves to be used as um, agents to hold Queen Naomi, that Queen Naomi has not done anything to them, the family have not done anything to them, that they have paid them to say a whole lot of things about Queen Naomi's mother, and you know, that when they go um, to go and do this at the red, this their work, that most of them, they are always on their computer, blogging, writing things, and saying a whole lot of things, uh, debunking things they are saying about other lorries, and all of that 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 is what they are being paid to do that if um, they will be paid to kind of debunk um, things that are not okay that uh, bloggers are saying about Olori, that that will, Olori, that will not be a bad thing. But if they are going to be asking them to say things that are untrue about Queen Naomi, that is where they will have a problem. And they don't want to do it again. They said one of them was saying she's too old to be doing that, that she's got children. Most times she thinks about how she would be feeling. 
if people were doing that to her own children, that she's not going to continue with that job again. That is not what she is called to come and do on earth. She's called to add value, not called to condemn other people. That is not fair. She's not going to put up with that kind of job again. And I said, yes, so that the glory of God is God who is making all of these things happen. I said, those who gather um, uh, 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 against you, Will will, reuni will will reunite or uh, unite for you. Ah, don't be angry. English is hard. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you. <laughs>